So, this video is actually a bit different from the usual stuff I have on the channel. This is the homepage for the upcoming game Sea of Stars, and it's a retro inspired turn based RPG to quote Sabotage Studio themselves. They are the devs. And I was part of the Kickstarter for this game. And as part of that pledge, I now have the opportunity to create a little memorial stone that will be featured in an area called the Crypt in the game. So I thought we would do that together, but I also wanted to feature the game as such. So this is the homepage. And this game drew me in because it has a visual style that is very akin to classical games such as Chrono Trigger, and I think they actually mentioned it right here. Yeah, if the messenger was a love letter to the likes of Ninja Gaiden, go back please. Ninja Gaiden, sabotage, follow-up title, Sea of Stars, is an adoring, stop doing that, not to the likes of Chrono Trigger. So yeah, the messenger is uh, a game that this studio previously did, and it was pretty good. So if you have any sort of affection for games such as Chrono Trigger and other 90s, I would say, these days called retro RPGs, then this game just might be for you. So this is the homepage. They have quite a bit of uh, good footage and artwork and yeah, info blurbs such as these ones. So that was kind of the appeal for me and I pledged. Yeah, this map that you can see here on the right side is very much chrono triggerish so yeah if you like this type of games this might be a project worth checking into but that's not why i'm here today today i will do a memorial stone so yeah let's uh yeah also 2022 so it's a bit still to go but it it's out there so yeah having shown you all this and said all i had to say let's move into this memorial stone creating thing shall we the backers of certain levels have the opportunity to design a memorial stone for an area I think called the Crypt. And I just got my link from the dev. Let's get into it. Solstice Warrior. Dear backer, it's now time to let us know what you want your memorial stone to look like in the Crypt. Note that you won't be able to edit this data after submitting. Please take all the time needed to make sure you're pleased with the final result. One. Your stone design. Select the value for each part of your stone. The final result will appear as is in the crypt. All right. So we have body and base. Let's start with the base. So do you want like a little thing on it? Cracked stony thing? Get a little greenery, a lot of greenery. Okay, let's go with a lot of greenery for now. And then, okay, that's plain. It's very regal looking. Oh, 20, wow, there's a lot here. Crumbled green thing, not so much green. That looks almost new, so you can actually have like, yeah, so it looks a bit, um, Sterile, I think. Let's have a little bit of green there. Crumbly, crumbly. That one was pretty cool. Try to remember the 16, number 16. Man, they have a lot of cool ones. Okay, that was cool. Eight. Let's go back to number eight. Yeah, that was cool. And I kind of like that. Yeah. Your memorial name. Write down your name or the name of the person you want to honor. And I might as well stick to it. Let's see. Yeah, that's how an I is spelled out in this form. So I'll, I'll be naming myself on, um, or maybe the plinth here in the background, maybe those are what we will have as an end result. Anyway, I'll stick with that. 
your memorial text. Select the line of text appear on your memorial. Never forget, Reggie's. Oh, oh we have a little selection. Never forget, here lies in honor of, in memory of, therein lay. Rest in peace. May we forever, I thought it was, may we forever forget, which would have been a bit sassy, but may we forever remember, for the love of my life, for my son, for my daughter, father, mother, to the greatest, in loving memory, for my friend, for my wife, for my husband, love, beloved, for the best pet. Okay, that's a little out there. Um, I guess you could have had your pet as the, the name, for sure. Forever remember, precious are the memories to a true here, to the fiercest, kindest, bravest, funniest. May your memories live on, Regis. Oh, wow, there's a lot of, a lot of ones here. Yeah, let's go with that. May your memories live on. It's, it's vague enough to be both good and bad, I suppose. Uh, confirm your choice. Before submitting, please confirm that you're 100% satisfied with your stone design. The spelling of your memorial name is correct, is it? Yeah, it is. Your memorial name can't be interpreted as offensive. Well, I don't know every language, but if there's uh, something very bad called a Regis or a Regis, then I uh, simply have to apologize for that. Not my intention. Your memorial name text doesn't contain copyrighted. As far as I know, my name is not copyrighted. So I think we are cool all over the board here. Failure to comply with these rules could result in having your stones not added to the game. That would be bad. Okay, so we have it. One last look. I'm cool with that. Oh, preview. Okay, nice. That's very nice. Uh, let's just go with the 16 again and see if that would have looked cooler in game. No, that's that's sterile. Uh, then we would have come out. No, they didn't have that with some greenery. Uh, okay, let's have one last look here. I think that looks pretty cool. Yeah, I am well pleased. Submit. See you, Star Survey. Um, and all set. Thank you for the support, friend. Your stone will be crafted immediately. You'll discover it in Sea of Stars. Here's your retrieval code. It was also sent to you via email. This code will allow you to find your stone in the crypt effortlessly. And, uh, well, obviously, my dear viewers, you will not see that um, code. You know, just makes sense. And neither will you see my, well, it's not really secret, but, you know, I'll keep some of that stuff myself. What's next? The next fulfillment wave will be the platform service coming after official console's announcement. Stay tuned. After that, you can continue to support Sea of Stars by adding it to your Steam wishlist, following us on our social accounts, or spreading the word. It truly makes a difference. Cheers. So that is kind of what I'm doing here. Uh, sea of Stars looks really, really promising if you are into adventure RPG games, and uh, the the devs, Sabotage, have uh, they've done good stuff before, so it might be worth looking into if you haven't heard about this project. Anyway, that is uh, all there is to it in this video. Hope to see you in other videos ahead, but for now, it is. Bye-bye.